Hello everyone, welcome to Wondershare Filmora Tutorials. In this video, we are going to see that how can you quickly merge two video files without having to create a project in Wondershare Filmora. So Wondershare Filmora is a video and an audio editing software that allows you to generate professional quality videos. So the basic step in this particular software is that you need to create a project and in that you can apply all kinds of effects, animations and manipulations onto your raw footage. Whether it's a video, whether it's an audio, whether it is an image file. But what if you just want to merge two videos, then you do not need to go through the whole process of creating a project, importing the files and then just simply merging them. You have an easy out option that allows you to simply just merge the two video files and export them. This not only increases the efficiency but tremendously decreases the time that is required to create these kinds of videos. So let's see the process which is pretty simple. Open up your Wondershare Filmora. Now you will see this kind of a screen. This is actually a project screen but we are nothing to be concerned with it. So what do you need to do is go to this file option, go to import media, select the last option that says import with instant cutter tool. Let's just click on that. So there are two options in there, trim option and the merge option. So I'm just going with the merge option because I want to merge two video files. Okay. Now I'm going to just click on open file. Let's just select two video files and click on open. So these two are opened. Now what I can do is. I can just select this file. Uh, if you want, you can actually even play this file. Okay. Or you can just uh, slide the slider as well. Like this. Okay. Now. If you see the total duration shown over here, it is 3 minutes 47 seconds. If you see the individual duration of these video files, it is 1 minute 41 seconds and 2 minute 5 seconds. So if you just add these two durations, it would be 3 minutes 47 seconds. Now what else you can do is, uh, let's say, you want to, uh, now you have actually merged these two files. Okay. Now, if you want to change the files, let's say I don't want to merge this file. So what I can do, I can just select this file, click on this delete option. That file is gone now. Or let's say if I want to like change the uh, sequence in which the files are merged. So firstly, I want this 15th file. Then I want the seventh file. So then I select the seventh file and then it will come after this file. So this is how you can create. Um, change the sequence or actually change the video files. If you want to add some more files, let's say I add the third file. So then this file is added again. You want to add the seventh file again. Again, you click on that. So what happens is these four files will be merged. First 15th file, then seventh, then third, and then again the seventh file will be merged. The total duration would be this much. Now uh, let me just delete some of the extra files. Okay, let's just delete these two files. Let's just keep these two. Uh, and click on export. So what happens? You are supposed to select the output folder, provide a name and a path. This is the default path that would be selected. But if you want, you can change this path. This is the size that you will get. As soon as you click on OK, this whole video file would be exported into the folder, taking a meager of uh, two to three minutes, depending upon the speed of your computer. So this is how the process becomes super efficient and super quick. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.